Now, if you're going to do card fans, obviously you have to exhibit them to the audience, and there are varying ways in which you can do that. We can make a fan here. Or you can change to the other hand, and do the same thing in the right hand. Now, if you're playing in front of a large audience, then the traditional way of showing the fans is out here. Obviously, you must keep the fan facing the audience. Not like this, so that you can see them, so the audience can appreciate the design. You can do exactly the same thing, of course, on the other side, to get the other two designs. Never learned how to do I learned it by looking at a magician on TV and trying to figure out what he was doing. To make the one-handed fan, place the cards about half the deck in your palm. Get your index finger and your pinky on either side of the card. You're going to grip them like this. They should be able to stand free in there. The thumb goes to the back lower corner of the card and pushes up. Meanwhile, this finger moves around the index finger and pulls the cards down as far as they can go. Now sometimes when you're first starting out you'll just get a bar of cards, a straight line of cards. But with practice and holding the cards firmly and getting your thumb into the right position all the way at the bottom left, slowly pushing up and the fingers pull down. That's very important because that creates the curve of the fan. The thumb continues to push up now to do this in both hands, start with the deck in your right hand. Break about half the pack off with your left thumb and rotate the cards around all the way. So now we have two blocks of cards facing each other. The thumb comes down and back, pushes up, fingers pull down. Same thing in this hand. Thumb pushes up, fingers pull down. Now, you can push the cards together, making a riffling noise, and make the S fan. Slowly bring the cards back together and square them up. This is the one-handed fan. Another technique for the, the giant fan. Now for the method. What you need to do is to split the pack approximately in half. If you can, try to try to make this, the the top the top half of the pack slightly slightly thicker than the bottom half, so it, it'll weave the bottom cards. And also, as you line up the pack, try to give the uh, the edge of the uh, the cards a slight bevel. You do that with both, so they kind of weave together when you press them. You see that? See how that goes? Now they over together like that. And you hold them in a position similar to the uh, the two-hand fan with the noble pack, and then your thumb and your thumb and the middle finger engage and hold the pack at the point where they intersect. Okay, and then and then the action is, is precisely the same as making a two-hand fan. You go around like that. Yeah. And then you can split them off like that.